Hello everyone and uh, welcome to another one of my uh, traditional wet shaving videos. It's been a little while since I've uh, made a video but um, I've had other projects uh, going on. But uh, it's great to be back doing um, what I love. Today I'm going to uh, feature one particular product from uh, True Fit and Hill. It is this. The Apsley scent. With uh, hints of cedar and uh, patchouli. Um, I find this uh, particular cream to be uh, to smell very similar to that of the DR Harris Windsor scent, but um, I'll go ahead and uh, review this uh, particular cream for you anyway. So, as you can see, I'll shave with this, and for the pre-shave, I find this works best with uh, using uh, True Fit and Hill uh, creams, the Taconic unscented uh, pre-shave oil. Okay, and uh, for today's shave, I'll use uh, the Parker 26 Open Comb Razor. It's uh, fairly aggressive, but uh, that's kind of what you expect from any uh, open comb razor. And uh, the aftershave, it's only fitting if I uh, use the uh, True Fit and Hill Absley uh, Aftershave Balm with this. And for my brush, I have uh, softening up here in hot water. My trusty old uh, fine long uh, horsehair brush from Spain. Okay, so uh, I know you're looking forward to uh, <clears throat> finding out what uh, this entails, so let's get started. face up there a little bit, <clears throat> apply a couple of squirts of this, okay. just for added protection. So how's everybody been doing? It's summertime here in uh, Ontario, Canada. Oh, very lovely. Nice sunny day. Bit hot, but uh, hey, I'll take uh, a hot summer day over a very brutally cold winter day any day. Trust me. Even though I'm a Canadian, and uh, we're quite used to uh, winter weather. However, summertime is always very nice. Okay, so um, I'll go ahead and uh, apply the lather to my brush. Yeah, it's the nice thing about uh, these kind of creams. They last a very long time. And uh, you don't need to apply a whole lot to the brush either. Okay, I think that's good enough. And I'll go ahead and mix this up in my trusty old uh, shaving mug. It's just a regular uh, white coffee mug, but um, <clears throat> it definitely uh, still works. All right. Just gotta find uh, the right mixture, the right level of consistency for uh, the best thickness. Okay. 
Oh, I love the smell to this. Mmm. Smells divine. Definitely work. Close to my face. Yes, I'll do three passes. Okay, now, apply the lather to my face. I can finally get started with this shave. I'm using a, an Astro Blade, a fresh Astro Blade with this razor. And uh, as with any uh, open comb razor, you just uh, want to take uh, the strokes nice and gently. Not too much pressure. And it's always, I go with, my first pass is always with the grain. Yes, the uh, folks at True Fit and Hill, they certainly know how to uh, make quality uh, scented creams. Yes, I read that this uh, particular cream uh, was named after the first uh, residents 
the residence of the uh, first Duke of Wellington in London. It's n now a museum. Yes, I wonder what, what the uh, Duke of Wellington um, himself was like, Sir Arthur Wellesley. He must have been an extraordinary gentleman. A man who is able to defeat Napoleon Bonaparte and restore order to Europe. Mm-hmm. Love the scent of this cream. It's a bit on the pricier side. Uh, I know I for this I paid $38 Canadian. And I think, if I can recall, oh, $80 for the bottle of aftershave. But... Once you uh, use this, these products, you'll know where that extra money went. Okay, first pass done. Yeah. Oh, face already feels nice and smooth. But I'm definitely going to go for the uh, baby uh, smooth skin. Okay. There you go. So... Okay, I'll prepare for pass number two. Just had to make sure it's all nice and even that there was enough applied to my face. All right, so I'll go cross grain for uh, my second pass.
Hmm. Yeah, I can feel the slickness of this cream. This razor just gliding across my skin. I can really uh, pick up the uh, sense of cedar and uh, musk and patchouli. Quite pleasant. <laughs> and this helps to give a close shave as well, this part of the 20C, 26C razor. It's just mowing down all this facial hair. Yeah, I had about, a, about three days worth of uh, growth on my face. And this razor just uh, took it all down within seconds. All right. There. Oh, it feels nice. However, I'll uh, do a third pass, go against the grain. Yeah, I'll just take the uh, rest of this out of the brush and just squeeze it out and uh, plow all the excess cream to my face. I'm not going to uh, do 
the buff, I'm not going to apply the buffing technique uh, with this uh, particular razor since it's open comb. And uh, I think uh, it's open comb razors are a bit aggressive for uh, applying buffing as your, for your cleanup pass. So I'll just keep the shave to within three passes. Okay, third pass against the grain. Hmm. Feels rather nice. Yes, I would highly recommend uh, True Fit and Heal products to anyone. Anyone uh, who wants a classy cream that performs well with a nice uh, rich scent. Personally, I think in terms of scented creams, um, True Fit and Hill. Uh, the True Fit and Heal brand is the best, but don't get me wrong, um, you can get some very, very decent ones from uh, Taylor Roll, Bond Street, and D.R. Harris. And although I, I haven't tried uh, the, brand, the brand Geo Trumpers, uh, I hear that's pretty amazing too. Mm-hmm. Well, I don't mean to sound uh, conceited or anything, but, uh, oh yeah, looking quite handsome. Mm-hmm. I want to look, I want to look quite handsome for my girlfriend. Mm-hmm.
Okay, there we go. Just had to get into my uh, trouble spots there. All right, so I'll go ahead and rinse off and uh, apply the aftershave. Alrighty. Wow, it feels great. Face feels so nice and smooth. Yeah, yeah. Just pat dry the skin. Now go ahead and apply this. The aftershave balm. The absolute scent from True Fit and Hill. All right, and there we are. Okay. All right, so there you have it. So, uh, this has been a video review about True Fit and Hill Apsley Scent Collection. I uh, find this to be a, a very uh, attractive scent. I don't um, find it to be a, as uh, particularly uh, strong as the uh, D.R. Harris uh, Windsor scent. Although, uh, yeah, they are, these two are very, very similar to each other. But um, don't get me wrong, this. Uh, works well. This uh, cream uh, works very well when you la lather it up. Um, much like uh, any other high quality cream from uh, 
Taylor of Old Bond Street or D.R. Harris and uh, Trumpers. But um, yeah, this uh, was well worth the investment. I got a very nice, close, uh, comfortable shave. Yeah. Cheeks look, cheeks look great. And uh, the scent is just uh, amazing. Although, as I've mentioned, not as uh, strong as uh, D.R. Harris Windsor, which I think uh, I like more. That's uh, my more uh, my preference. So there you have it, uh, a wonderful uh, shaving cream. Uh, wherever you are, I hope you are having a wonderful day. I hope you're having uh, great shaves, and I hope you're trying out many, many kinds of uh, shaving creams, many kinds of scents, and um, yeah, absolutely, if you like this video, I uh, ask if you uh, please like and comment. Uh, please share this video amongst your friends, your colleagues, co-workers. Um, yeah, so a nice shave. Okay, so anyway, this has been this is Sean wishing you well. Have a great day and peace and namaste. Bye for now. Thank you.